Hi, I'm Ellen Ferrara. Welcome to Top Tips for CIOs. And today we're talking mobility with Jonathan Brasnett. Jonathan, a flexible, completely mobile organization, is that a threat or an opportunity for a CIO? Oh, there's no question that it's an opportunity for a CIO to really make a difference to their organization. I mean, you know, by reconfiguring that organization, the CIO can take out real costs, such as buildings. Um, by changing the way in which people work, you can reduce the need for office space. Um, you can eliminate unnecessary journeys. Um, and in that way, you can take enormous costs out of the organization. And at the same time, you can drive up productivity by giving people the capability to work anywhere, to access corporate information from anywhere. You can increase your response times. You can increase your responsiveness to customers and in so really drive up the productivity of the company. Mm. Cost, productivity, great arguments for the CFO. What about softer creativity? What, what advantages have you seen? How do you see a workforce act when they're in a really mobile organization? Well, I think it really frees people up. It frees them up to be where they need to be. They don't have to be in the office, and they don't have to spend lots of dead time traveling to and fro from the office. And also, I think it helps people's work-life balance, and that feeds into the kind of creativity and the kind of commitment that they have towards the company. So I think flexibility works on a number of levels, mm -hmm. cost, productivity, but also it really enhances the ability of the employee to contribute to the organization. Now, if I'm a CIO putting my mobility strategy together, there's a lot to think about. What are the top three issues that I should put on the top of that okay. list? Well, I think, I think the first one really is about the information. Um, what kind of information, what kind of applications and business processes do I need to make available to whom and where, or essentially everywhere? How do I do that? Uh, the second point is how do I do it securely? Mm -hmm. And, you know, I don't know if you knew, but over 900 laptops go missing every week at Heathrow Airport. And on average, for every security breach incurred by a company, it costs them one and a half million pounds. Ouch. And that's before the reputational damage kicks in. Uh, and last, it's about how do I do this whilst at the same time taking cost out? How do I manage this complex uh, organization and deliver a robust service all at the same time? And what would be number one on that list if you had to pick? Well, I think, you know, in, in these times it has to be about how do you take cost out of the organization? And, you know, CIOs find that very hard to do at the moment. Mm. Uh, they find the mobile costs uh, difficult to control, particularly with things like um, the increased uh, personalization, consumerization trends, and of course, very often purchasing decisions can be localized. So it's a hard environment for them to control. But they can do it. Well, we can help them do that. And how does BT do that? Well, again, I think there are a number of ways in which we can help. First of all, it's about our experience. Um, we pioneered flexible working for our own organization. And since then, we've worked very closely with our corporate and government customers to help them do the same thing. I think, second, we've also got the right portfolio and services to offer our customers. You know, we can help them deploy secure remote access. We can help them mobilize those applications and business processes to make them available to their field workers. Um, and we can help them manage those costs by deploying our mobile expense management services, which will help them first understand those costs, manage, and then reduce them proactively. Now, Jonathan, BT has a lot of experience, but they don't have a mobile network. Is that a problem? No, I don't see that a problem at all. Um, the reality is that the mobile data connectivity is, is, is the easy bit, and it's the bit that's being commoditized. The part that's more difficult is really about how do you help the worker, the organization, um, and how do you actually uh, enable the organization to exploit mobility. And this is where our experience and knowledge around business processes, around applications, and systems integration really helps us. And we have a great deal of experience and professional services capabilities to help our customers work through those issues uh, in order to gain productivity and cost advantages. Thanks for sharing that. My pleasure. For more information on mobility or any other topics in networking and IT services, please visit bt.com forward slash global services.